Hey everybody, it's Jay Janess with the Slash and Mini Network, and I have a review for you. The Rocky Horror Picture Show 35th Anniversary Blu-ray. Now, this is really nice. Uh, I guess I could talk to you about the packaging first. It, when and if you ever get your hands on this, you'll notice that it doesn't have the traditional Blu-ray case. Uh, it actually has like a little book type feel. Now, what I'm showing you here are just like little photo stills and photo shots of some uh, promo shots and a couple of scenes of the movie. Sorry for the glare, it's kind of bright in here. But it, it's a really nice package. And the way the Blu ray sits, it it's in a little sliding type sleeve thing, but don't worry about damaging it. it the Blu-ray itself, it, it doesn't move all too much, and you have a little indentation here where you can actually take it out. And it's not too bad. And it sets in really nice, unlike some other cases that come in these special editions, and they want to almost try to damage the Blu-ray or even DVD, depending on the package. Now... I, I was kind of expecting a little bit more from this 35th anniversary Blu-ray edition. I mean, I, I like the idea of the shots and everything. I, I really do. But it it's not quite what I expected. I mean, as you saw, we have a little liner note here explaining how it's about time that they finally release something like this and whatnot. <coughs> And I, I guess I could read it for you, since, since it's not going to spoil anything. Sorry, it's taking a little bit of time to find it. I, I should have bookmarked it. Alright, it says here, To the faithful and the virgins. It's hard to believe it's been 35 years since Brad and Janet's faithful, faithful mishap led them to the strange castle where they would meet Dr. Frankenfooter and his transsexual trans Transylvanian pals. That That's all I'll read. I don't want to give too much of that little liner note away. But to get on some technical aspects of the movie, when you view this, you will find that it shows up in its original as aspect ratio of 1.66 by 1. Which is really awesome, because sometimes with older movies and even some other movies, they tend to crop the picture so it fits the entire screen. And I really don't like that, because sometimes what they even do, unfortunately, is they sort of stretch the picture. Now, with an aspect ratio of 1.66 by 1, you might see a little bit of a difference in the stretching to fit an actual widescreen TV, or you may not, for those of you that don't really pay attention to much of any of that. Now, that's not an insult. But, for someone that has an eye like me, or, or many others, you will notice it right away. But, this movie, thankfully, retains its original aspect ratio. I love that. The other thing here is, is when the movie originally released in theaters, it it had a mono sound. Now, in in other current releases and this 35th anniversary Blu-ray edition, it's now in stereo. But what I like about this, unfortunately, I didn't have a surround sound to test it. But this has a one point, my fault, a seven point one surround sound channel which is really great I, I really wish I had some surround sound so I could test it out but unfortunately I don't and I love this the the picture is very crisp in a lot of older movies you'll notice that there's a lot of grain and the picture was not really cleaned up all too well but it looks like they took very good care of trying to do that with this movie and I love that You'll, you'll notice little spots here and there in the movie. You'll notice a teeny bit of grain. But all in all, in the end, the picture quality, it's really great. The colors pop, 
and the blacks are really really deep and it also depends on how you calibrate your television so keep keep in mind of that as well I love this I, I would definitely suggest picking this up and if you don't have it and you've never seen it do yourself a favor at least check it out rent it buy it really cheap or something you never know you might like it but I definitely suggest that anyone that has not seen this pick up the movie and at least watch it and those of you that are fans of the movie pick this up you will not be displeased with it and his that's my review thank you everyone have a good day take it easy J Janess here with the slasher mini network like us subscribe check out check us out on Facebook at www.facebook.com slash the SMN network. Have a good day.